but it's been one thing i've been celebrating her so much i haven't been putting the focus on me Yo, YouTubians, what's good, y'all? It's your boy Marcus X Hulk, and I'm here to welcome you guys to my channel where we learn how to get financially and physically fit. Now, if that's what you're trying to get into, you're in the right spot. So go ahead and smash the sub button for your boy one time for the one time. So today we have a trenches video. Now, trenches is my weight loss journey, so I'm showing you everything that I'm doing wrong and some things I'm doing right, but it's been more wrong than right so far. But anyway, we're not gonna harp on that right now maybe we will but you're in the right spot just go ahead and hit the like button for that um for me losing my mind right there so we do need to talk about how the week went right so every monday i do a weigh-in um if you want to catch my weigh-ins before i actually drop these videos go ahead and follow your boy on instagram you won't be missing much like i post almost at least once when i feel like it i'll do better i promise all right so last video that you guys seen and you know I got that up there for y'all if you haven't seen it um, I kind of talked to you guys why I was gone for a while just kind of dealing with life just trying to get ahead of the game um, had some things go down at the job that you know made some made some some waves not bad things but some some more things where I had to be a little bit more accountable so I was kind of focused more so on work um, I know that's more of a money tree subject, but we we gonna get to it. It kind of affects the weight loss journey too. So let's talk about the week. Um, one great positive thing about this week is my wife has joined me at the gym. Yes, she is now back in the gym. She's got her energy up, and I love the fact to see her in the gym. But it's been one thing. I've been celebrating her so much. I haven't been putting the focus on me. Um, and that's not a negative thing, it's just that I'm losing sight of what I'm supposed to be doing. So, I'll work out with her, and I'm kind of training her a little bit. I mean, she knows what to do, I'll just give her a few pointers, and I mean, she's very coachable. As soon as I tell her, she, boom, she's in it. She, she knows how to do it. But, it's not the style of workout that I'm used to. So, with her, we're doing um, pretty much a upper body day, lower body day, upper body day, right? Uh, so we work out three three times a week. And the cardio is like 10 minutes. Now me, what I'm used to doing is cardio for at least 30 minutes, um, at least three times a week. And then like I'm trying to work out six days a week. So I have cut my working out into half. But it's not necessarily a bad thing because I kind of haven't been working out at all. So it's one of those seesaw things. Um, I love the fact that I'm in there with her though, but I just have to know like, all right, you got to put in the work too. You can celebrate her, but what about you? I mean, we often go around life not thinking about ourselves, but others. So we might put others in front of us, but it's not a bad thing. Like that's not a horrible trait. It's just, you got to remember, put yourself first sometimes. So that's what I'm going to focus on going forward. Make sure I'm putting myself first, not forgetting about her. Like, of course not, but I got to put myself first. Um, because if I don't put my oxygen mask on, I can't help everybody else. If y'all fly, y'all know what I'm talking about. All right. So that's the gym. Let's talk about nutrition. Now, nutrition has still been horrible. I'm not going to lie. I ain't going to fake it. I ain't going to hold you. It's still been horrible. Um, I haven't meal prepped like I'm supposed to. I've been buying food and literally having to throw it out because for one, I'm not checking expiration dates when I buy stuff. So, you know, that's dumb on my part. And two, I haven't been cooking. So since I haven't been cooking, I've been having to throw it away. So I've been relying on the snack bar again. And yeah, this time it's getting worse. Your boys have added back the ramen noodles. I don't even think they're really, they're like the top, you know, the cup of noodles, not even the ramen noodles, not the real joints, the cup of noodles. So, yeah, I'm slipping on that end too. So, after telling you all that, um, tell you about the weight, um, tell you about the gym, tell you about the nutrition part. So, I guess we need to go ahead and get into um, what that weight is, right? So, I weighed in last time at 265, right? 
I, no, I'm sorry, 263. I weighed in this time at 263. So by the, by the grace of God, I have stayed in the same spot. So how it happened, I don't know. Um, got to do better. That's all I got to say. We, we, we got to do better. We got to focus a little bit more. And we just got to get to it. So that's all I got for you guys for today. Um, I had to wear a little bit of Georgia stuff, you know. I know it's not close, but it's close enough. You know, go ahead and get my go dogs. We're trying to three-peat. But I act like I'm on the field. I'm not even on the field. In anywho, so that's all I have for you guys today. Make sure y'all smash that sub button for your boy. Go ahead and hit the like too. Share the video. Share it to somebody else that's on the journey. And um, yeah, just if you are on the journey, just keep, keep going. Keep going. I know it's going to get rough. I know it gets tough. Uh, but you just got to keep going. So... Make sure you guys tell somebody you love them. Do it now because you may not get the opportunity to do it later. Until next time, peace.